We have some breaking news to get to now. The Sacramento City Council just voted on a measure to ban homeless camps near levees along the river and outside of public buildings. Now, this change is angering a lot of folks. There were even protests outside City Hall tonight. So let's get you over to Mady Gomez. She's live there tonight. Bring us up to speed, Mady. That's right. Hey, you guys. So the city council passed the vote unanimously. Basically, the city is saying this is an effort to protect critical infrastructure. But keep in mind, homeless advocates, they're not buying this. And they're saying that the homeless situation is not going to get better by passing this vote. City leaders say moving homeless people away from levees along the Sacramento and American rivers is critical in preventing catastrophic damage protecting the levees, which some have been bored into. They say homeless people living on the levees have dug into them so deep it is putting the city at risk of flooding in the future. The new rule city council members are discussing would allow the city to stop people from camping within 25 feet of the riverfront levees. Outside of City Hall, Homeless advocates protesting say the new rule would only criminalize the homeless and not help them find shelter. If you put this ban into effect, all these people are going to be brought up from the, from the rivers, put back in front of the businesses, back in front of the neighborhoods, and the police are going to sweep them every 72 hours. Civil rights attorney Mark Marin says unless shelter is available, city leaders cannot criminalize people living on the streets. And jail doesn't count as shelter. Besides the levees, if the new rule passes, homeless people will no longer be able to camp within 25 feet of hospitals, bridges, fire and police stations, as well as other public buildings. At last count, Sacramento County's homeless population was more than 5,500 people. Some of them spoke at Tuesday's city council meeting. Betty Rios says she's been living on the streets for 15 years and is running out of options. There's no houses out there, there's no spaces out there, so there's nowhere for us to go. So again, Sacramento uh, City Council passed the vote unanimously just a few minutes ago. Keep in mind, this will go into effect in about 30 days, and anybody who violates it will be fined between $250 to $25,000. Back to you. Mm -hmm. wow. Of course, the question is, how do you even enforce that? Folks who don't have anything, uh, they don't have the fines or the money to pay that type of fine. Of we thank you for that live breaking news update, Mady.